Okay, so the general idea of this practice is going to be that I am going to be the opposition. I do, however, have some restrictions. I'm not going to play full out, so to speak. Uh, instead, I am going to uh, try and present you with challenges that are prevalent in multiplayer games and mm. tactics and such. So I may pick a diff. I will not pick the same operator. I will most likely just pick an operator that will teach you how to handle a, a different situation. And mm -hmm. after that, I'm going to explain pretty much what I did. But this also means that you will have to master the art of droning. You'll have to try and see what I do. Uh, but you will start off as defense, so... You don't have to tell me what you're doing. As if I would. And we will also be mixing different... Different uh, play styles. So, oh boy, I'm hearing a damn drone. Yep. Whoops. Yeah, Things this, I should. This is a common tactic where you're trying to, in in uh, by making the drone go close to. The hostage or another uh, player, you are trying to draw fire. Seconds. And this, especially in the early stages of the game for against new sight. players, this is highly effective. Yeah. So I have scouted where the hostage is. So now it's my duty to try and reach that position. Now I'm not, not going to do that in what I would say is the efficient manner I would use in a multiplayer game like this also just playing for for honor and everything like that. Mm -hmm. Instead I'm going to do it a bit more Assassin's Creed style. Either way, I have to say that you picking Bandit is most likely the better option compared to picking Rook, since Rook is, while a strong operator in his own right, he needs support to be truly effective, since his entire ability is based around it. The problem with what you are doing now is that you are somewhat predictable. Meaning that I can basically check around here, see what you're doing, maybe for one of these out. My poor, poor little battery. Ooh, all nice. Four eliminated all you were actually quite prepared for that one. Yeah, it was kind of like, I knew that you saw me with your drone, so I thought I'd switch position regularly and yeah. listen to what you're doing. That was a very good move by you, actually, so... So now I get to defend the hostage. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to have fun. You have to, how do I deploy the drone, by the way? The drone will be the can be deployed with the number six button, but it will be uh, deployed automatically in, at the start of the round. That's the droning phase. Fortify the room. You need to keep the hostage secure. So this is going to be interesting because you are going to get to try and reach a location that you have recently defended. If I would find it, that is. It is my sincere hope that you can. Down to ten seconds. Because I, I actually think it. you might be able to. Five seconds and counting. 
Oh, you're not in. No, you you're not in the same uh, oh, place where I was. No, no I, I'm not. I... In fact, I'm in a, a quite different place. You will have three minutes on you, on the clock. And Probably won't be able. <laughs> it won't even be able to find you. We'll see about that. I have actually learned not to underestimate you, so that is a good thing. But I technically can deploy my drone again, right? Yeah, and you, you can you reuse your drone. Op 4 has a 20 on the hostage. Mm -mm. You're on the wrong floor. Oh boy. Yep. What do I have to do that? What do I have to can I do against that? You can either be Against the S on mine, you can't be. You basically can't do anything because it can only be detected by IQ. But you have to be ready to get to the hostage. Oh, friendly victorious. Hostile. I actually was uh, didn't actually mean to shoot you at that regard. I was just going to g do suppressive fire, and then you accidentally got hit. <laughs> but that, that that was kind of no, good. But, You're you can, you're I know. I oh, what I tried. Uh, what I tried is like I I open up the door and uh, I open up the hatch, but I didn't want you to know where I am, so I tried to go the other way around. But I actually got kind of lost. And well, I didn't know. Like, what do you do when you're poisoned? Because you're dying. Well, well you can either pause and pull that thing out with the F button, but that oh, takes I didn't time. do that. And. Uh, I know w w your situation was b a bit difficult. You could have aimed at the shield, or you could have aimed at, you know, the other thing. Uh, at the corner, thinking I was in the corner. And what you sh I would have advised in that situation was more aggressive droning and not be afraid to storm the room directly afterwards, if you know my what I mean. Because in that in that position you had a pretty good advantage because the enemy would be in front of you either way. Uh, but when it comes to Ten if seconds. you see a room with that is empty and just a hostage in it, in that Five regard, seconds. just sprint with the shift key towards the hostage and clear to engage. Find the hostage and grab and the hostage. To because if point. I try to shoot you in that, if I try to hostage shoot you located. then. There is a high oh. possibility I will actually hit. Wait, uh, damn, I, I, I think I, yeah, I took recruit. I yep. forgot because I was listening to you. <laughs> oh, shit. Damn it. What is happening? This is a Twitch drone and they are annoying. What I'm doing with the Twitch drone right now is, however, not the way a Twitch drone is supposed to be used, I might add. Uh, a Twitch drone is mostly to snipe gadgets of one or another kind. Mm -hmm.
when it comes to the cameras, in a one versus one game, it's not always wise to use the cameras. Since you don't actually know if I'm going to sneak up on you while you're using the cameras. That was, that was not bad. Yeah, it was it was tight. Yeah. Uh, when I, I have a laser sight on that pistol, and do note that when I have a laser sight on my pistol, you can see it. So if you see a red dot hanging around a wall somewhere, most likely that means that there will be someone aiming in that general direction. Mm-hmm. So, let's see, who should I pick this time? I want to be very different, so you can actually learn different things you may encounter. Mm -hmm. you need to protect and I, I to hope I'm good room. with that as well. Well, I'm so, if, if it isn't for different tactics, at least I'm learning to... Uh, Learning different operators and different different uh, abilities. Yeah, because even at casual, even if you are very new to the game, you have to expect to face all of this, and that is part of what makes Rainbow Six Siege so great. It's not like you can only. It's not like you can only. Uh, Ten only have one operator and one set of gadgets. To there are a lot of them. Mm -hmm. Op 4 has eyes on the hostage. Good thing that I have such a bad sense of orientation. Well, at least now you have a sense of where I'm supposed to- Oh! Where I'm supposed to be. <coughs> Sorry. No worries. Remember that time is on my side here. I know. Remember to, to keep your objective in your mind, meaning that if I, if you think I'm <coughs> just trying to distract you, I'm most likely am. Hostiles eliminated. Yeah. Oh it boy. Wa it was a good choice by you to try and go for the hostage when you know knew I was not going in the same direction. But Cap can. Yeah, but Cap can. Alright, so now we're gonna try something completely different. Do you have any questions by the way or something that you would like me to try and ex expose you to? No. Not really. I still don't know how the damn 
um, the, 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 what they called, uh, the... The drones? Uh, no, the... Cameras? The... Squeaky squeaky things. Um, nice yeah, I yeah, I just I just gonna try some stuff. Yep, yep. you do that. Ten seconds before insertion. I didn't know that you immediately blow them up. Insertion in five seconds. <laughs> They're not mines, so. Hostage located. Whoa, that was fast. Yeah, that is Ash specialty. Shit. That is basically rushing. I was just... I was... I was going to reinforce exactly that wall. Yeah. I have to say, you did far better than I would expect uh, from a person who hasn't actually tried Rainbow Six Siege in multiplayer. Because... First of all, you shown an impressive ability to adapt, hmm. uh, meaning that especially when I went cap can, you found a good position to try and counter me from. Now, in a team game, you would. Ah, oh, that's interesting. Uh, yeah. Uh, start now. We. I don't get XP for that. No, it's a custom game. Mm -hmm. Because uh, if you would get the XP from a custom game, custom people game. could you, abuse you would, the system. Uh, yeah, exactly. But that's okay. It's but, the same in Overwatch. Yeah. So now it's a different map and different everything, basically. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So now I'm gonna try something else. Oh, that's actually kind of fun. Mm -mm. And I know, the entire Ash thing was really mean, actually. Yeah, but the game itself is mean, so that's okay. Location. Yeah, but uh, basically there are Ash players that will play that aggressively with a free speed operator. So you have... Usually it's a suicidal tactic, but not always. There are... And now we're not playing hostage. Now all you have... All that the, a person has to do now is to hold down the fort, basically. Meaning that if you stay in that room, I can't win. But if you stay in the room, you turn a bit more vulnerable. So, it's... You have to find a balance between the two. With mm -hmm. the hostage, you can go Five a bit further ago. away and still protect the hostage. But here, your opportunities are not as big. So this is Hereford Base, one of the more popular maps in the game. Oh crap. Did you get hurt? Yeah, from your bandit squeaky thingy.
life. <laughs> <laughs> That was how, <coughs> that was basically how nitro cells are never used in the game. How the designers most likely envisioned they would be used, <laughs> but they're most likely to be thrown and then uh, uh, um, immediately uh, used Detonated, afterwards, yes. right? Yeah, because I wanted to like when you opened up the hatch, I was like, this would be the perfect opportunity to throw one, but I already attached one uh, to the wall behind me so that I don't have to. Uh, look around all the time. Yeah. So now we are going to channel our our. Uh... Oh shit! I, I I choose recruit. No. We need to protect. Why? The I hate recruit. The Damn it. Basically, we are gonna keep on. The, keep the evil eye on this one. Valkyrie. Yep. I'm gonna channel my inner Aspira. Do it. Speaking of Aspira, uh, there are muscle breaks in this game, and I have a friend with a 3D, pr 3D printer. So he has printed the Rainbow Six Siege muscle breaks. Sweet. For my guns. Five seconds. There is a possibility that he can print me more. Uh, and if so, I'm going to keep them as community container. giveaways, basically. Sweet. I didn't find shit. And... We'll see if I'm I do. Useless. Well, I can hear you, but I can't really see you, so... Uh, one thing you should try and make a point of is blast the cameras, because right now you're giving me free access to try and see where the fuck you are. And that's not a good thing for you. I know. But I don't know where the camera locations are, so... Yeah, learning to spot the cameras takes something getting used to, so... <laughs> I was going to be sneaky and try and sneak up on you, and once I got that first shot off, it was far too late. But this, this was only because I was listening, trying to hear if I could hear you walking around somewhere, because I had no idea in what direction I should go. Oh. Alright, so now we're gonna try two tactics at the same time. Because I'm mean like that. Find the biohazard container location. But the thing was, since I was crouching, I'm very difficult to hear. Now, if that had been a real game, I would have most likely just have used my MPX and just shot you straight, but... <sighs> I wanted to play a little bit, and that's what's what's caused my undoing basically you say that but i'm two two to zero leading so <laughs> yeah i know <laughs> nah, just missing but seriously at least one of those cases Ten was I, I'm, I'm not playing how i would be Five in seconds. a game but one versus one games are well also done. a bit Biohazard different since in a container and secure it. in a in a in a 5 versus 5, you always have teammates that can watch your back, so... But now this is going to be interesting. But, uh, part of what makes a 1 versus 1 interesting is because... You are currently now on the ground floor, I know that. But... It, it also gives me a bit more liberty, since in a... In a real game, you would have teammates who would watch your six, or watch the other floors, or stuff like that. And you also have a more limited number of barricades than you otherwise would. Ah! I was kind of banking on you being close to that location, so I suppose I have to find... 
Yeah. The problem was that once you heard the sound, what you should have done was run away. I did, and the, but there was a wall behind me. <laughs> <laughs> because the only way you're gonna beat the fuse charge is to run away. Yeah. It's not like you can stare at it angrily and it just goes away. <laughs> Maybe Tatanka can, but... <laughs> no, not even Tatanka, sadly. <laughs> not even the Lord. Don't question the Lord. The I question the, the Lord! Sorry, How dear. dare you? Sorry, Dina I... Leader. I question the Lord. Sorry, I have to report you now. And uh, <laughs> all your Prima 6... Uh, um, stuff will be revoked from you. Crap, that's Man. what you get for insulting the Lord to a Rainbow Six community dev. Yep. Down to 10 seconds. 5 seconds. No, I can't find you again. Found the biohazard container. Well, I'm not going to tell you. Why not? That's mean. You're mean. I am mean. Maybe there's someone, not not even anyone here. Have you considered that? Maybe no. this is just a big empty building. Now you, now you're messing with me. Maybe there's a clown somewhere. Maybe you will float too. Why would you do this to me? Why would I not do this to you? But I heard something. Oh, you did? Did you hear something? Yeah. Op 4 has found the biohazard container. Oh shit! Eliminated. Mission successful. Ah, that's why. Since it was the last person, I couldn't interrogate you, sadly. Because otherwise that would have been an injured and I could would have interrogated you. And that would have been quite awesome. Okay, so now we're gonna pick another one. See what we can do about that. It's 2-2 two -two in matches. Seems like the Lord likes being insulted, you know. Wow. Find the biohazard <laughs> so, off to find you. One drone to find them. One drone to find them. Oh wait, that's not right. Wrong franchise. Oh god. Has been located. Oh no! Insertion. I'm blown to shit. Insertion in five seconds. And so we go. Biohazard container located. Proceed to its location. I'm not really sure what tactic to choose in this situation. Because you have a very strong defensive position that I will not be able to break all that easily. In fact, I have a shit operator for breaching things. I have, however, a decent operator for putting shit on fire. Wow! Yeah. I didn't really mean to the thing is, you need to be a bit quicker to move away from stuff that's gonna burn you, basically. Yeah, but uh, I was laying on the floor, so... 
Yeah, but still, the sprint button is your friend. Oh boy. Why does it automatically choose uh, recruit? That's not cool. Like, yeah, you should, you don't but pick you, anything. Should, you should be quicker to pick sludge this time around then. Yeah, I mean, obviously, but still. We need to protect the biohazard container. Secure the room. We get, after this map, we're gonna play one more map, and then we'll see about... About maybe... Uh, yeah. Calling it off. If that's okay with you. Mm -hmm. Down to 10 seconds. Now, my next operator is a very lazy Five seconds and counting. Op four he doesn't really like... Op 4 has located the biohazard container. In fact, he oh. hates working. Uh, it's Echo. I think. I've been spotted, what the fuck? Yep, you've been spotted. Where's that shitty drone? Not a drone, camera. Where's that shitty camera? The fuck? I don't even know where to go. You don't have to know where to go. Oh. You, you could get inside and try and get undercover. And hope there are no cameras where you're going. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh, crap. Ah! Oh boy, I should not be alive, but I am. It is now I should remind you that you have a giant big hammer that I will be hard pressed to counter. Oh crap. Yeah, there it is again. Where's that shitty thing? Yeah, I know it's in. Where can it be? I know that it. You have to get inside a room in 10 seconds. Time expires in 10 seconds. Or you lose. Prevent further access. Five seconds remaining. Nice! Mission <sighs> failed. All friendlies have been neutralized. <sighs> Like I said, I'm a bit handicapped by the fact that I have to focus on my operator's gadgets, basically. But that's because guns pretty much play second fiddle to gadgets in this game. Mm-hmm. Um... So now it's overtime, since it's free so, free. Yeah, so, um... When you first stunned me, the, well, like, when you stunned me the first time... Yeah. Uh, were you after me, to try to kill me? I can't kill you with Yoka. No, You're... no, no, but but with uh, with uh, with Echo, were you coming after me when I was stunned? No, because Echo is immobile when uh, using Yokai, and switching is actually 
kind of tricky we to do. To protect the biohazard okay. Container. Security. Because I I thought this is it. I'm gonna die. He's gonna kill me now. And I actually uh, managed to ex escape. Uh, even though my you sight managed was to accept blurry. your fate. No, no, no. There's still while my sight was blurry, I managed to um, to breach another uh, breach another window and um, escape outside. Yeah. Climb up yeah. the roof. Where's that Ten seconds. Down to five seconds. Shit, but I still haven't found... What are you looking for? Found the exactly. But I still haven't found... What I'm looking for... This practice is actually a bit... This one is actually going to be a bit different because this is actually not going to be just what you need to get used to. It's also going to be what I am going to get used to because I just picked Ella and I have barely played her. Oh, but I have yeah. to look at the floor. Basically, it's just another trap operator. I have no idea why Ubisoft is so fond of trap operators this season. But I think it's like, how can we buff IQ? Well, we need to make sure there is a bunch of stuff IQ needs to work for. Uh, there we go. Great, you found one mine. Can you find mm. another one? Probably. It's not like I want to. <laughs> Yeah, you know, fuss. The problem is, I have no idea which mine you triggered. So, I need to keep a good memory about what mines I've actually... ...actually put down. And remember, hammer on walls is a good thing. I know! If you... Oh, on walls. Yeah, yeah. I forgot about that. Because uh, th that's the main prob main uh, thing... If, uh, new players forget about Rainbow Six Siege. You can and should break the walls. In fact, the more thing that breaks, uh, because if as long as the doors are the only thing I need to keep my eye on, it's quite easy. But if I need to keep my eyes on a bunch of other things, it's not as easy. Oh, is that T? Op four has spotted the biohazard container. Okay. Nice. All friendly. I were fully expected you failure. to just retreat and try and outflank me because. To be fair, not many experienced Rainbow Six Siege players would have just lied down and wait for me, so... Kudos to you, you won that game. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> MVP! <laughs> that was really fun. Yeah, so one last match and we'll see how much I can teach you in that, and then you should be ready to tackle the situations all by yourself. Or just Hopefully. return to Overwatch. Both should work. <laughs> so now we got to choose Presidential Plane. And this map is a lot different from the ones we've had. Because it's a lot more linear map. Mm -hmm. And it's a trap where spawn peaking and similar is rampant. Meaning people are really up to spawn peaking on this map and similar. Mm. <laughs> Fun fact about the operator I'm going to pick now. Uh, his main role wasn't always what it is now. Instead, it was that Ubisoft once had an idea about an operator that would be able to attack, who would skip the drone phase and just attack during uh, the preparation so you phase. So you're playing uh, Mr. Sniper? No, that's glass. <laughs> no. But this map is actually not a bad 
bad uh, bad place to show off what's facing glass is about because glass on this map can shoot through the airplane windows. Ten seconds. Fuck off. No, I don't Insertion want to do that. Seconds. It sounds rude to fuck off stuff. Hot is located. But no, today we will be the insufferable, unstoppable juggernaut. Oh, Montagne? Boop. Boop. Pop on the nose. I should not do this right now. Oh no, it's blitz! Fuck off, I can't see shit. <laughs> I don't want you to see- Oh! Uh, nice. <laughs> I should really have been shooting more, but I I fo really thought you were very, very blind there. But you see, you just got past me and then- Nice. <laughs> I just remembered that uh, melee attacks were a thing. And I was yeah. like, well, I can't shoot like this, but I can. Of course have, you can. I, I, I do have a knife. You do have a knife. I like knives. So you're going to gonna kill me now by spawn peeking, yeah? Exactly. That is exactly what I'm about to do. Because I wouldn't actually showing, be showing off this map if I didn't try to subject you to spawn peeking at least once. And if I'm gonna subject you to spawn peeking, I need to do so on the location where spawn peeking is most common. Shit, I still haven't found this fucking hostage. Where the fuck is it? In this kind of situation, you can usually draw... You can usually guess based yes, on where I am. So... Yeah, but for that, like, I don't have a sense of orientation. I need that marker to know where you are, to yeah. know where... Yeah, so I have no idea where I... You have entered an enemy controlled area. Leave now. You have been spotted by hostiles. Fall back. You're outside. Maybe. If you remain in this zone, you will be detected by hostiles. You have been spotted. The funny thing is, I don't know where you are, because people in siege are, can be predictable, so... You will be detected if you remain in this area. Your location has been compromised. So usually you can just aim and shoot If you remain in this zone, you will be detected by hostiles. You have been spotted. Oh, it landed on the wings. At least now I have delayed your approach. Here, operator, operator, operator. Friendly is victorious. Ah, shit. Being silent is also a thing, you know. I have good headphones on me, so I could hear your approach from quite some distance away. Yeah, but I didn't want to sneak up, like, all the way through the bottom of the plane. Yeah, I can understand that. So, what now?
Now, I think we should take it a bit more easy. We need to locate the hostage. Oh yeah, I'm in a drone. Aha! Did I kill it? What did I... yeah. You killed the drone. Of that, you can have a little doubt. Well, I would have preferred if I... Blasted Ten it. seconds to insertion. Killed it before you found me. Insertion Actually, in didn't that, I didn't find you per se. I don't have a marker up. So technically Rescue your position is, is still secure. Find and secure the hostage. Yeah, but... You know, I know, I know. Come on, I'm sometimes what the fuck? If you if you let go of the barricade thingy. In the last seconds, it still goes back to nothing. Yeah, I know, it's silly. What the hell? Four eliminated. Friendly mission successful. Oh, come on. I'm sorry, but this is the way you learn. <laughs> I just, I, I was about to lay down. Yeah, but Glass is a harsh mistress on this map. Yeah, I figured I that much. Sorry? I figured that much. Okay, so now we, I think we're gonna put something familiar up against you. Mostly because I wanna use this weapon skin, I never ever get to fucking use it. I never picked a shotgun as this Fortified operator, so and still here. I invested quite a lot in a very good looking very good looking skin for his shotgun. But I never actually use it and that's very annoying. Yeah, how dare you? It's not my fault his submachine gun is so good. Oops. What happened? Ten seconds. Oh, remaining. nothing. In fact, I know what happened because I Down got five seconds. First. Good work. Hostage location secure. What the? F okay. You can't say fuck on this show. I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm out of reinforcements. How shit is that? Yeah. basement as you should be aware by your drone scout so. and as you just realized drone scout is technically a starcraft term
I sincerely has one of the nicest pistol skins for Bandit at any rate. Remember, time is on my side. I know, I know. Nah. He's victorious. Hostiles eliminated. I didn't give you much of an option there, but you should have run for the entrance that oh. was already open since I can shoot through it. Yeah, but I knew that the wall next to it was uh, uh, was with um, yeah, with but the bed. The, on the other side there was one unbarricaded, one barricaded, and then the open one. So yeah, but I can't see that from the other side, can I? Yeah, you can. Oh, yeah, by the hooks. Oh, damn. That's true. Hmm. So, match point. Need to recover the hostage. And now I shall find you. What is a bit interesting is that I don't know if you have headphones or if you got speakers, but I can hear some of your louder in-game noises. I I have I have um, headphones. That's very interesting. I shouldn't be able to hear them, but yeah, but they're badly calibrated. So. All right. What model do you got, by the way? Uh, something something razor. Damn you! Go away! Leave me alone! I have the HyperX Cloud 2. Uh, I spent two years owning the Q-Pad model. And it was kind of fun, because when I got the Q-Pad QH90 model, uh, I was going to a store on Black Friday, because I had to. Uh, my old headphones was busted after like five years or something like that. Mm -hmm. And I was going to just get headphones on sale and nothing else. Uh, I left the place with my 27 inch 144 uh, hertz screen and I have no idea how that happened. <laughs> it just happened. Well, it was cheap because I remember the total cost for everything wasn't even above like I think I got it all for 350 euros. Oh. oh crap! We have been eliminated. I thought you were was going to be in the corner because uh, when I open open up that place, I expect people to be in the corner because it's the best place to be since you need to expose yourself to get to it. <laughs> so I was going to, you know, put you through all the kinds of sledge, and what happens is that I die. <laughs> because I don't like sitting around for too long at one place. That's something you la learn in Overwatch. Stay still and you die. Yeah. Basically, Rainbow Six Siege is not different on that account. It's I mean, just... there are you. You have to be in a location to keep uh, track of uh, what to see, yeah, but especially because you found me with uh, the drone. Yeah. Um, it's important that I'm not where you last saw me. Whoops. I have no idea where I'm going. This plane is way too big. If you ever flew with a plane, you know, planes are not I bad. have, Yeah, I have flown with a 747 and a 777. And I know that you speak the immortal and eternal truth when you say planes are not this big. Because... Like, I, even I, big I, I, planes are not that big. I don't even need to search you, I can just look at the plane because I'm not going <laughs> to find you anyway. And I know that you're not... Uh, where you not are, but... Are you sure that you know that? Uh, pretty sure. And... Maybe, maybe I am Doomfist. Have you considered that possibility? Yeah. Also, fuck this barricade. Mm-mm. 
Oh, nice. Friendlies were eliminated. Mission failure. That was actually very good. I have no idea what I did. I just shot back. <laughs> Over time. <laughs> so, what dreadful menace should I pick for you today? I really want to pick something I haven't actually... Yeah, I know exactly what I'm gonna pick. Trumbo! Okay. <laughs> you say that? To recover the hostage. I do say that. Oh, there you are. Hello. Hostage located. Can you just leave? Please okay. go. Bye. Bye. I mean, you know where I am anyway, so... Don't tell Rick, but I still know where he is. Ten seconds. Five seconds. Yeah, we better get back in there and see if, the, if Rick is up to any shenanigans. I mean, we can't accept having shenanigans here. Fuck your shit. Stop your shenanigans! Cease <laughs> shenanigans! <laughs> Smoke, out! Cool. Man, I love it when I don't see shit. Oh, crap. Well, if you don't like, if you like when you don't see shit, yeah, thank you. I guess. Retrieve the hostage. Could you not? Man! How was I supposed to find you like that? Hostage extraction successful. Okay, that was just pure showing off. But it was also quite nice to use Ying in that manner. It wouldn't have worked if you had teammates, so that was a, something that could only have worked in a one versus one. Mm -hmm. But it means that we are very even. Three kills, three deaths. Hmm. We even have the same connection. <laughs> <laughs> and now I'm just going to leave the custom game and... Hope that you found this entire thing entertaining and also a bit learning. Yes, yes, definitely. That was actually really fun. Alright, I would suggest that you try out the situations next, because they give a lot of renown, they give a lot of time behind the different operators, so when you pick your next operator, you will be more into what... The operators can do and above all else never satisfy for anything less than all three stars on the situation so you make sure you never have to go back and do them again okay we'll do that all right and good luck thank you